So the thing that helped me with Elle a lot is that she's very different. When she goes to Harvard, she doesn't really belong there. She's wearing all her pink suit and then she also has her dog with her compared to all like the tweed and dark and neutral colors. So in terms of that, I think that I'm also kind of stick, stick out too because people don't, don't expect Elle to be Asian, dark hair, Channeling that the sense of insecurity that I feel felt with this at the beginning and the sense that I do stand out and that I am unique definitely helps me take on the persona of Elle a lot more. I've been singing for quite a bit of time. I did choir, show choir, musicals, that in high school and stuff. But then the thing with this one is that I never properly learned how to warm up so I could always just kind of like belt my head off and then not really worry about damage or anything but with this one she has such high songs I had to really work on breathing proper support warming up so I don't hurt myself later this this play has a lot to do with women empowerment and feminism and just girls looking after girls you know oh my God. Women are constantly being subdued and they're not allowed to speak out of place and not allowed to show any real like big emotions. They're meant to be demure and still like just kind of keep to themselves. But obviously Elle doesn't keep to herself. And so I think she, you can look up to her as really a, a great role model that stands for what she believes and goes after what she wants. And when something doesn't work out for her, she doesn't stand and cry. She just keeps going and moving forward. So I think that can be a really good message for younger girls um, because like I said, times are changing. And it's about time that we had a person like Elle come through.